Would you rather pay $650 or $66 for a smartphone? Simple. With the Appalachian Advantage plan, pay less up front and then just a few dollars more every month. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Following Paintsville's second cancellation of the Kentucky Apple Festival, the city of Paintsville will host Autumnfest in its place. Wednesday, we spoke with Paintsville Mayor Bill Runyon about the announcement. Uh, so what we decided to do was to give them an opportunity to make up of uh, two years of loss of revenue, uh, is to go ahead and open our streets up uh, and let them come in and uh, uh, charge them a small fee for their vendors and their arts and crafts uh, and let them make as much money as they possibly can because we know they're hurting. Last held in 2019, the Apple Fest was one of Paintsville's primary resources for local fundraising. Since announcing the Autumn Fest, Mayor Runyon hopes that it will help out local organizations. So we're calling it the Paintsville Autumn Fest. Uh, and we've got a real short time to throw it together. We know there's going to be glitches. We fully understand that part of it. Uh, but we feel like as a city, city government, and uh, that we owe it to our uh, uh, nonprofits and our citizens to try and put something on for them so they can make uh, a little bit of money. In conjunction with Paintsville's Autumn Fest will be music by Alley on Main's Alley Festival held on the same week. They, they now have 20 acts coming in, so starting Thursday afternoon and running all the way through Saturday night, there's going to be one act right after another uh, going on at a place that a new restaurant just went in called The Alley, uh, and they've got a stage area and a large parking lot set up behind the restaurant and uh, they're going to have several, several good acts coming in. Paintsville's Autumn Fest will be held from September 30th through October 2nd. For vendor applications, you can contact Paintsville City Hall at 606-789-2600. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Cordial.